The Story of the Elephant and the Monkey Once upon a time, in a dense and lush green forest, lived a wise elephant and a mischievous, clever monkey. Despite their different natures, they were good friends. The elephant, named Dhiru, was known for his calm and steady nature. He always completed his tasks patiently, without rushing. On the other hand, the monkey, named Chiku, was quick, agile, and playful. He was an expert in outsmarting the other animals in the forest with his cleverness and agility. Chiku always thought of himself as the smartest and often teased Dhiru, saying, You are so big and slow. If we compete in any task, I will beat you every time. Dhiru would just smile at his words, but sometimes he thought that Chiku needed to understand the true meaning of cleverness. One day, a grand gathering was called in the middle of the jungle. It was a special day when all the animals showcased their talents. As usual, Chiku was boosting about his cleverness. He proudly declared, I am the fastest and smartest in this entire forest. No animal can compete with me. The animals laughed at his words, but deep down, Chiku considered himself the best. Teasing Dhiru, Chiku said, Can you match me in a race, Dhiru? Why don't we race to the top of the hill and see who gets there first? Dhiru calmly listened to him and said, All right, Chiku, if you're so insistent, I'll accept your challenge. But remember, it's not just about running fast, it's also about reaching the destination at the right time. Chiku thought to himself, The elephant is so slow. I'll win this race easily. The preparations for the race began. All the animals of the jungle gathered, their eyes glued to this exciting competition. They all knew that Chiku was fast and agile, but they were also aware of Dhiru's patient nature. This was going to be a very interesting race. As soon as the race began, Chiku shot ahead like lightning, jumping and swinging between the trees. In just a few minutes, he had left Dhiru far behind. He was swiftly making his way, leaping from tree to tree, and soon disappeared from Dhiru's sight. This is too easy. Chiku thought to himself. He paused midway, climbed a tall tree, and began enjoying a large fruit. Dhiru is way behind, he said to himself. I can afford to waste some time. Chiku was so confident in his victory that he decided to rest for a while. Meanwhile, Dhiru steadily continued on his path at a slow and consistent pace. He knew that the direct route to the hilltop was difficult, so he used his years of experience and deep understanding of the jungle. He knew of a secret path that went around the back of the hill. It was longer but had no obstacles. Dhiru chose this path and kept walking without stopping. Back in the forest, Chiku lay on a branch, gazing up at the sky. He thought, why not rest a little longer? The elephant must still be miles behind. He was so sure of his victory that he didn't care about the time and continued to rest. After a while, Chiku decided that Dhiru must still be far behind, so he resumed his race. He leapt between the trees again, but now he was slightly careless. He was so sure of his win that he didn't pay close attention to every turn in the jungle. His speed was still great, but his cleverness was beginning to falter without patience or caution. When Chiku finally reached the base of the hill, the sight that greeted him took the ground from beneath his feet. At the top of the hill, standing proudly, was Dhiru, smiling gently. His calm and steady victory was written all over his face. Chiku was stunned. How is this possible? He gasped. How did you get here before me? Dhiru smiled and said, Friend, a race isn't just about running fast. It's also about choosing the right path and maintaining patience. I took a route few people know about and decided not to stop. You ran fast, but you rested along the way. 
Patience and the right choice are the true forms of cleverness. Chiku realized his mistake. He hung his head and said, "I thought I could always win just by being fast. But you taught me that patience and choosing the right direction are just as important. I became too arrogant and that's why I lost." Diru placed his hand on Chiku's shoulder and said, "We all learn something from one another." And a true friend is the one who helps us realize our mistakes. From that day forward, Chiku gave up his mischief and arrogance. He understood that not only speed and cleverness, but wisdom, patience, and guidance are also important in life. He began to make his decisions with thoughtfulness and patience, and his friendship with Diru grew even stronger. The animals in the jungle also learned a valuable lesson from this incident. They now understood that in life, it's not just about moving fast, but about advancing in the right direction with steadiness and patience that leads to true success.